sounds like you're battling with inner childhood. I actually have a great relationship with my childhood. My childhood was damn near perfect. Not going to lie. I had a solid one, dude. I'm still alive. I ate every day. I walked. Yeah. Rode a bike to school. Every around. time I was hungry, it was my fault. You know. So. <laughs> I think I think there's nary a time in my childhood life where I was hungry. I don't think I've ever been like cold. <laughs> <laughs> you know. I don't think I've ever been dirty I've for more than like a day. a day in my life. <laughs> oh, I've been cold, but I've never been so cold that like I can't like function. You know. Yeah, yeah. Lights always been on. Always had. I mean, I don't have heat, but it's an old house. And you know, like California. No, there is there's no AC as a as a mm. child at home. It was an older house, you know, and it didn't get that cold in the past. It honestly gets a little more cold now. But you know, that's what blankets are for. All the amenities that I mentioned my parents didn't have when I was really young, but I was too young to remember, so I don't really care. AC? You know, probably like an AC heater. Um, ever, food shelter there was a time yeah. where like uh like the only house i grew up in i was like i just kind of assumed that was the only place my parents lived and then they're like nah we were moving hella and i was like oh what dude i thought this is just where like you existed for all your life and they're like nah <laughs> nah Damn. homie we kind of lived before you as well whole lot of life before you kid <laughs> But you know, you then you just showed up one day and you're like, all right, I guess we're going on this road now. Fucked lots of women before your mom. Whoa, I didn't need to hear that, father. Yeah, and you know what? One's on her way right now. <laughs> <laughs> we're getting a divorce. <laughs> like, oh, well, sounds like it's a you guy problem. Well. 